Media Mark Weather Show. Let's get into some uh, weather across much of the eastern part of the United States and especially the Northeast. And we're going to take a look at uh, precipitation amounts first. Very summer like pattern across the region. Of course, across much of the Northeast here, we'll generally see about an inch to inch and a half with a frontal boundary that I'm going to discuss. Here out west, things look pretty clear, especially Texas here. Texas is looking the driest it's been in a while. Across portions of the central and northern plains, upper Midwest, that's where we'll see a lot of overrunning precipitation here. Bouts of showers and thunderstorms, which really could get a lot of heavy rains going. Let's take a look at that uh, northeast forecast, of course, for your heading on into Wednesday. Across much of the east here, and of course, the northeast for that matter, into southeast Canada. And you can see here, across the Ohio area, up towards the Lake Re Erie region, southern Ontario, that's where Wednesday we could be getting in on the act of some strong thunderstorms here. Damaging wind, large hail, from uh, especially from Cleveland on southward here. Maybe Pittsburgh could be getting in on the act of this as well. Western parts of western Pennsylvania, maybe extreme southwestern New York. On the day on Wednesday, those showers and thunderstorms will pretty much be out of a lot of the northeast by then because the first frontal boundary will be sagging here to the south and across much of New England, for that matter, and southeast Canada. But then we start to get a pickup of moisture here Thursday. We'll still have a little bit across the far southern portion of our forecast area, south central Pennsylvania, maybe a strong thunderstorm possible on Thursday, extending back towards Pittsburgh as well. But mainly across much of the northeast, we'll be dealing with cloudy skies as this low pressure gets going near New York City, Long Island area. We'll have a lot of clouds and maybe some overrunning precipitation in parts of New England here up towards uh, Nova Scotia, maybe as far north as New Brunswick. But temperatures will be running a little bit on the cool side as you can see on Thursday across the northeast corridor here. 60s being the general rule across the area. 70s further south towards those areas of strong thunderstorms on the southern portion of our forecast area. That's pretty much going to do it. That'll take us through the rest of the week here. But don't forget to uh, check out the five-day outlook all for all my hometown viewers in the Susquehanna region of New York, upstate New York, and northeast Pennsylvania. Don't forget to like me on Facebook at MediaMark. Subscribe to me on YouTube at MediaMark.com. Here's that five-day outlook. From Binghamton to Scranton. Look at these high temperatures here. We'll be looking at uh, highs pretty much into the 60s, maybe approaching 70 on Thursday with a lot of clouds to be had here Wednesday and Thursday. Wednesday, not too bad, sunny, but we'll have some clouds later in the day. Heading on through the rest of your work week here, we're starting to look very nice by the weekend here. Friday and Saturday, crystal clear sunshine, Temperatures mainly in the mid to upper 70s. I'll have my complete hurricane forecast coming out in the next couple days. That's going to do it here at Meteor Mark.